Alright, welcome back guys. Venom here again with uh, part 5, I think. Part 5 of Undertale. Alright, so let's continue on. I didn't take a break from last time, I just uh, re-recorded so I can get on with the story. No computer. Ah, it's just like you want. It's like it's just like you to run away. I am the ghost that lives inside a dummy. My cousin used to live inside a dummy too, until you destroyed their home. Us ghosts spend our whole lives looking for a proper vessel. Slowly, slowly, we grow closer to our new bodies, until one day we too may be corporeal. Corporeal beings. Beings able to laugh, love, and dance like any other. But you! My cousin's future, you took it all away. Despicable, despicable, despicable! Human! I hope you're not too attached to your body because your soul's about to get evicted. That dummy blocks the way. Foolish! 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 Even if you attack my vessel, you'll never hurt me. I'm still incorporeal. You dummy. Wait. Is dummy a compliment? Hmm. Ow, you dummies! Watch where you're aiming that magic attacks. Hey, you! Forget I said anything about magic. Feeble, feeble. Ow. Smells like a clothing store. I'll defeat you and take your soul. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Two hits. Hey, guys! Dummies! 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 Remember how is it not to shoot me? Well, failures! You're fired! You're all being replaced! <laughs> You see my true power, relying on people that aren't garbage. Dummy pot's magic missile. Oh. Thank you. 
Worse than the other guys. Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? I don't need friends. I've got knives. I'm I'm out of knives, but it doesn't matter. You can't hurt me, and I can't hurt you. You'll be stuck fighting me forever, forever, forever. <laughs> It rain. Oh, forget it. I'm out of here. Sorry. Sorry I interrupted you, didn't I? As soon as I came over, your friend immediately left. Oh no. You guys looked like you were having fun. Oh wait. Didn't you attack me before? Uh, that's awkward. Sorry. Have a nice day. Well, I'm going to head home now. Just warning you, so don't accidentally follow me to my house. You probably wouldn't like that. Got no choice. Oh, hey, you followed me. My house is up here, so you probably don't want to come this way. Hope that helps. living. It's living. Oh hey you, followed me into my house. Make yourself at home. Home? Make yourself at home? I'm working on a mixed CD. Make yourself at home. Classic spirit tune. They don't make songs like this anymore. Oh, are you hungry? I can get you something to eat. This is a ghost sandwich. Do you want to try it? Oh. After a great meal, I like to lie on the ground and feel like garbage. It's a family tradition. Do you want to join me? Okay, follow my lead. Here we go. You'll lie down as long as you don't move. So, only move around when I get up, I guess. Well, that was nice. Thank you. The hell? What do I need that for? Oh, snails. Awkward. I'm working right now. I mean, welcome to the family snail farm. Yes, I'm only an employee. This place used to get a lot of business, but our main customer disappeared one day. Now it's just some hairy guy that shows up once a month. Hairy guy? Who's the hairy guy? Oh, a box. Whoa there! I've got some neat junk for sale. Minus five defense, invincible for longer.
Well, that thing was shooting me. Seven, seven human souls with the power of seven human souls. Our king, King Asgore Dreamer. He will become a god. And with that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the service back from humanity and give them back, give back, give them back the suffering, the pain that we have endured. Understand, human? This is our only chance of redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. Undyne! I'll help you fight! Yo! You did it! Undyne is right in front of you! You've got front row seats to her fight! Hey, you ain't gonna tell my mum and parents about this, are you? I know I'm not supposed to be here, but I want to ask you something. Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo, know, you're a human, right? Huh? <laughs> Man, I knew it. Well, I know it now. I mean, Undyne told me, and um, stay away from that human. So, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies or something. But I kind of stink at that. <laughs> yo, say something mean so I can hate you. Please? Huh? Yo, that's your idea of something mean? My sister says that to me all the time. I guess I have to do it, huh? Yo, I... I hate your guts. Man, I'm such a turd. I'm gonna go home now. <laughs> Yo, wait! Hell, I tripped!
What are you standing around for? Get over here, dude. I... I'm slipping! I'm dying. You saved me. Yo, I thought I was a goner. <laughs> Wait, are you okay? It looks like you fell pretty hard. This is my fault. I should have stayed away from them like you said. They just went straight for a fight instead of helping me. I was so scared and you... What? You're gonna go fight them now? You look hurt. You should rest. <laughs> Warriors don't rest, huh? I'm dying. You're really cool. Oops. Seven. Seven human souls and King Asgore will become God. Six. That's how many we have collected thus far. Understand? It's through through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as is customary for those who make it this far, I should tell you the tragic tale of our people. It all started long ago. Forget it. Look, Papyrus didn't come to this meeting today. Say what you want about him. He's weird. He's naive. He's self-absorbed. But Papyrus never missed meeting and no matter what time you call him on the phone night day afternoon morning he always answered it was within the first two rings but now he's gone and his brother isn't around either what did you do to him what did you do to him papyrus who i have trained every day even though i know he's too goofy to ever hurt anyone go ahead Prepare however you want, but when you step forward, I will kill you. Oh, Papyrus is dead. Oh. That's it, then. No more running away. Here I come. Oh, God. As long as you're green, you can't escape. Unless you learn to face danger head on. You won't last a second against me. Not bad, and how about this? For years we dreamed of a happy ending. Now, sunlight is just within our reach. Points heroic things towards the sky. I won't let you snatch it away from us. It's like dance room. Yeah! Enough warming up! Take it off, oh, bitch. Heh, <laughs> get tough. But even if you could beat me. No human has ever made it past Asgore. Just stop being so damn resilient.
Anyone else would be dead by now. Alphys told me humans were determined. Oh, <laughs> what? I see now what she meant by that. I'm determined too. Oops. So confusing. Nah, die already, little brat! <laughs> oh, wow. You're getting in my way. Will not be defeated. One hundred. No! You are stronger than I thought. So then, this is where it ends. No! I won't die, Alphys, Asgore, Papyrus. Everyone is counting on me to protect them. No! Human! In the name of everyone's hopes and dreams, I will defeat you! Come on! Is that all you've got? Pathetic! You're going to have to try harder than that! See how strong we are when we believe in ourselves. Just getting weaker. He <laughs> had enough yet. Oh, she's gone. Bandai. I won't give up. How slow it is now. Oh, it feels so bad. <laughs> Alphys, this is what I was afraid of. This is why I never told you. No, not yet. I won't die. No! I won't die. I won't die. I won't die. I won't. Oh. There is undying.
to evaporate from the heat. Copper evaporates it too. What the hell? So useless. <laughs> Seeing such a strange laboratory in a place like this, you're filled with determination. See. Right, this is part four. Uh, no, part. Of, this is part five of uh, uh, Undertale. Right, so I have killed Undyne. Uh, actually, this playthrough, like, um, being, being a warrior kind of m is, makes this story really sad. Like, they're actually not, uh, they're not bad people, and then you're just a human who's taking out everyone. It's kind of makes, makes it kind of really sad on my behalf anyway. But, uh... Like it makes a difference from my uh, cousin's playthrough. So he's he's played through this uh, sparing everything, and I've gone, I've gone through killing everything. So uh, you can see the contrast from here. Uh, I'll link you the uh, link to my uh, cousin's um, web uh, YouTube page, so you can uh, check out the the alternate endings and stuff. But uh, I'm going to finish this uh, this game. With uh, from using combat and violence, and uh, we'll see how the ending uh, variates. Anyways, this is uh, part five. I'll see you guys in uh, part six. Have a good one. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.